Welcome to a little craft by Penny crochet school. <laughs> I will teach you how to make this seashell. So let's get started, shall we? <laughs> make a magic ring. Chain one and make six single crochets. If you hear anything in the background, it's my little kid, Doris. As a mom of two, I don't get that much time, so I have to take the time that I get, and this is it. So, six single crochets in the magic ring, pull it tight, and make a slip stitch in the first one. Oh no, I made it a little bit too tight. <laughs> Heard it always. So, ah, slip stitch in the first one, chain three, one, two, three, and make double crochets in every stitch. One, two, three, four. Five, six, and now you'll have six double crochets and the chain three you made in the beginning. And slip stitch in the top of your chain three. Now we are going to start the spiral around and you have to chain two and make a single crochet in the second chain from your hook. Make a slip stitch in the next stitch. Chain one. Turn your work. And now you see that we have increased with one stitch. So one single crochet in there. And in the last stitch you always make a slip stitch, a chain, you turn your work and you make a slip stitch in the first one too. Single crochet. And now, slip stitch in the next one. And you see, when I slip stitch, I make a new stitch. Chain one, turn your work. Single crochet all the way up there. Now we have two single crochets. And one slip stitch. Chain one, turn your work, slip stitch in the first one, make two single crochets, and slip stitch in the next stitch. Chain one, make one, two, three single crochets, and in the last stitch, slip stitch, chain one, turn your work and slip stitch in the first one and make single crochets all the way down again, three it is now, so in total we have four stitches, Sing, single crochet, slip stitch into the next stitch, chain one and now one, two, three, four, five stitches. So for this one, we are going to make two in one. So we are going all the way up, slip stitch in the last one, chain one, turn your work, slip stitch again, and single crochet all the way down there, like so. And now, slip stitch in the same stitch. And we are not going to crochet in the last we made. So when you turn your work, skip that one because we are not increasing this one. One, two, three, four, and slip stitch. So five stitches in total. Slip stitch. One, two, three, and four. And now 
slip stitch into the next one. And why we do this, that is to make a little poof, nicer turn. Because <laughs> when you make two in one, you get a little more fuller gel. And now, chain one, turn, do not increase, crochet four, single crochets, and a slip stitch. Chain one, turn, slip stitch, and single crochet all the way down there. And slip stitch in the next stitch and now you can see that we have come around here so we are going to make this one just as the other ones like so oh here with my arm so single crochet all the way up here slip stitch in the last one chain one turn your work slip stitch in the first one and single crochet all the way down there again four single crochets five stitches in total and now slip stitch into the bottom of that one and do not increase make one two three, four, and a slip stitch. Chain one, slip stitch, one, two, three, four, five stitches in total. And now we are only going to work in the top of these. So if you can see this in the top here not in between only the top of these so we're going to slip stitch the first one is a wee bit wonky just slip stitch in there chain one and this one we increase so now I want five single crochets and a slip stitch one two three four five and a slip stitch. Chain one, slip stitch again, and one, two, three, four, and five. And here, if you want to, you can mark where the first, um, I don't know what I should call them. But you can mark here if you want to, so you know where you are in the beginning of the round. Uh, I do not do it, but if you want to, you can. And now we're just going to slip stitch in the next one. Boink. And we're not going to increase. One, two, three, four, five. Slip stitch, chain one, turn your work, slip stitch, and five single crochets. Slip stitch into the next stitch, like so. Chain one, turn your work. Do not increase, make six. <laughs> Stitches in total. I hope you got the hang of it now, because I will crochet a little bit faster so that the video doesn't get too long. <laughs> but basically you are single crocheting slip stitching and yeah so slip stitch in the next stitch 
and now it looks like this we have gone our little twist right here and as you can see if you compare them <laughs> it looks a little bit funny uh, but it will be better I promise so in this stitch I want you to increase so now we want six single crochets up here two three four five six slip stitch now my daughter is pulling the yarn <laughs> make a chain turn slip stitch six <laughs> single crochets three four five and six needles <laughs> now slip stitch in the same chain one do not increase six single crochets up here four And a slip stitch. I honestly don't have any written pattern so I'm just looking at my shell and making it. <laughs> Turn your work, slip stitch and crochet all the way down there again. Mm -hmm, mm. Six single crochets and make a slip stitch into the top of the next one. And now we made two in one again, and that is to get that nice curve going on. That's what I made here. And make a chain, turn your work, and do not increase. One, two, three, four, five six and the slip stitch chain one turn slip stitch and crochet all the way down there leaving you with one two three four five six seven stitches in total so this is what it looks like right now Oh, she's pulling the yarn. <laughs> Make a slip stitch in the next stitch. Chain one, turn your work and do not increase and make one, two, three, four, five, six single crochets. And in the last one, slip stitch, chain one, slip stitch in the first one, and six single crochets. Two, three, four, five, six. And there are no rules making this shell. If you want to make them longer, you can increase in the beginning. If you want to make them wider, you can make more double ones in one and um, this is just the way I did it and I'm actually just crocheting after what I'm seeing in this one so I'm not even sure if it will look exactly the same <laughs> uh, yeah slip stitch in the next stitch chain one you can increase if you want to you cannot increase if you don't want to you just go with the flow. I'm not going to increase in this one, but maybe in the next one. Oop, sorry. Turn your work and make six single crochets. I think I will increase in the next one. It will look good. Six single crochets, slip stitch, chain one, turn, slip stitch, Oop. slip stitch again single crochet all the way down there mm -hmm. now my little one 
is sleeping, so I have time to do this <laughs> in quiet. I will slip stitch in the next one and I will actually increase here. So I will crochet in the first one there. One, two, leaving me with three, four, five, six, seven. Chain the last one, chain one, turn, slip stitch, and single crochet all the way down there. <laughs> Hopefully my yarn is enough. <laughs> I'm not quite sure, but I have a little bit more. I'm only using scraps and I have a four millimeter crochet hook. In the next one, and if I look closely, this is almost the first one, and I am not increasing here. I will crochet my seven single crochets like so. A slip stitch in the last one, chain one, turn, slip stitch, single crochet all the way down there. Mm -hmm. And I will not sure. Yeah, I will make two in the same in this stitch. So slip slip stitch in the same stitch, chain one, do not increase. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and a slip stitch. Turn your work, slip stitch. the technique and how it's working up. Chain one, turn your work, do not increase and make single crochets all the way up there. And as long as you do this slip stitch in the bottom and work your way up with single crochets and slip stitch in the top turn slip stitch you can do this for how many rounds you want and just make sure you think it looks good looks right thick enough you know I am just giving you the tools make a slip stitch in the next one I'm not sure how many rounds I did actually <laughs> there. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, and there's my horn. I have more. <laughs> Let's see. Chain one. Turn your work. Do not increase. Single crochet all the way up there. And I am going to change my horn soon. Let's see if I can get my Probably can. Slip stitch in the last one, chain one, slip stitch, and when I change yarn, I make the beginning of the single crochet and I end it with a new yarn, and then I crochet it in there.
Oh, and I forgot to mention, you only single crochet in the back loop. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh. Slip stitch in the next one. See, make a chain, turn your work, and now I am going to increase actually. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a slip stitch. Chain one, slip stitch in the first one, and single crochet all the way down there. <clears throat> As you can see, it's starting to look like we're getting there. I will make a couple of more rounds. I will make two in this one, actually. So, slip stitch in the same stitch, chain one, do not increase, and single crochet all the way up there. I'm sorry for not mentioning you only crochet in the back loop. <laughs> Lucky for me, in editing, I can just add it in the beginning. <laughs> so no misunderstanding. Slip stitch in the last one. Chain one, turn, slip stitch. And single crochet all the way down there. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, and slip stitch into the next one. And chain one, turn your work, do not increase, single crochet around there. <clears throat> and in the last one, remember to slip stitch. Chain one, turn your work and slip stitch in the same stitch. Slip stitch, make a chain, slip stitch in the same stitch, and single crochet down to the bottom. Sorry for my filming, I have not made so many videos before. <laughs> mm, let's see. Now I think we're almost done. Mm -hmm. I will make maybe one more. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will make one more. Do not increase. And single crochet to the top. And you can also make this with t-shirt yarn um, so that you can make a big shell. That's what I have done to my daughter's room uh, so they have toys in it uh, and I'm planning on making a very large one um, to also have toys in. It will look really cute, <laughs> like a little accessory to the room. Now slip stitch into the next stitch and to finish my shell off I slip stitched in the top of these a slip stitch in every stitch so I just slippity slippity swap all the way to the top <laughs> I'm having fun at my own jokes so like this and then guys you are done with your shell. Hope you enjoyed this video. 
please follow me here. Uh, follow me on Instagram, Craft by Penny. Um, and thank you for watching and making this with me.